So, we're here now to learn about our dispensing. Uh, we have dispensing trays and we have a lot of items in our trays. And I'd like to welcome Luke Weens, my son, and Jasmine. And they're going to walk us through a proper dispense and what we typically do on a dispense. Okay guys, take it away. Hello, welcome to Dispensing 101. So this is called a dispensing tray. You can see they're white and they're polished, so it's uh, quite a nice, nice uh, thing to bring out and show the glasses off in. Uh, inside of your tray, you're gonna have the glasses cloth, because every customer gets a cloth for every pair that they get. Um, we also have the complimentary chocolate, and this is really nice chocolate. You can see it's from Charlie, so make sure you mention that. Charlie's chocolate. Charlie's chocolate. Charlie's chocolate. Um, a glasses case, obviously they're branded with Crystal Vision on the inside, so we always know whose case that they're bringing back. Bottle of cleaner. We have a little. Um, and that cleaner is refillable, isn't it? They just that's have refillable to bring it for back. life. Refillable for, for life. Yeah. As long as they bring back the containers, we'll always go in the back and refill them. And the the uh, formula. The yeah, and the formula for the clean, the cleaning solution is fa a family formula. It's something um, we don't really like the recipe to get out there, so Top keep secret. that confidential. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's patent pending. Yeah. Yeah. Um, this right here is a little podium for the glasses, so that they stand out, obviously, and they look really nice on there. Um, we also offer a twenty-five dollar gift card for every purchase. And this right here is a wallet-sized um, prescription card, and it's actually a health card because if you notice on the card here, we'll zoom in on that. There's a couple of different sections on here. One's for hearing, one's for vision. So as we continue now, uh, we're going to learn about some of the other items in the uh, dispensing tray. Absolutely. So last thing that we were going over was the health card, which has your prescription in it. And what also has a prescription in it is the thank you card that we uh, provide our customers with. So inside the thank you card is a... Um, obviously a thank you from the Crystal Vision family and it discusses a little bit as to what the glasses are going to be doing for you. In here there's also a hearing aid spot and a prescription eyewear spot. So this is the prescription for the hearing aids and that would be for the glasses. And at the bottom here is a, uh, the frame stylist who helped you choose the glasses. So they'll be writing their name down there. Okay. Um, on the back of here is a list of all of the benefits that you get from purchasing from Crystal Vision and uh, as well as a benefits card that goes on separately inside of the package and Jasmine's going to go through that uh, with, with you quickly here now. Um, so when you're with your patient and you're dispensing you want to make sure that you're going through and checking all the boxes. There's a back side as well. Um, so just go over and let them know what we offer and make sure you're adding the value to it when you're going over it. Uh, for example, free contact lens fittings, an $89 value, and then you'll just put a little check and just go through each one of these with your customer and let them know that you appreciate their business. That's awesome. Could we actually go through some of those? Sure. Oh, actually all of them. Let's do all of them. Why not? This is our training video. <laughs> Um, so here we have free contact lens fittings, an $89 value. Uh, do you want me to read the No, not necessarily, too? but I really love how you say the $89 value because we don't want to give everything just away free. We don't want the customers to think it's just free. Uh, everything has a value, but when you're a customer of Crystal Vision, you have benefits, and this is our way of explaining those benefits. Um, along with the free contact lens fittings, um, after that you are eligible for free contact lenses to try. Uh, free hearing testing, which is a $79 value. Free trial test of hearing aids. So after your test, if you do need hearing aids, you, this is available to you. Uh, free sight testing, a $99 value. Um, eyewear and hearing aid cleaning. So anytime you find your eyewear or your hearing aids are getting mucky, you just want them cleaned. Uh, nose pads changed or anything like that, it's free. Uh, unlimited adjustments and basic repairs. So. Same thing if um, your glasses are broken or lens pops out, just bring them in. Um, and then a $25 gift card for your next purchase. They don't expire. Uh, or you can give it to a friend or a family member. That's awesome. Yeah. And what's this down here at the bottom, right there? 
Uh, this here says let's be friends, so we have social media platforms on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. Uh, so you can follow, so you can stay updated with promotions and sales. And yeah, and this is also a great time to ask for a um, review. 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 And a five-star review is what we're looking for. One star, we don't want. Okay, just so you guys know. So these will all go inside of our dispensing bags. I like to tuck that guy into there because it's uh, nice and neat. I'm going to stick that in there. Just go down nice. Ready? So now we're going to talk about the uh, actual dispense of the glasses and a, a real great procedure on how we do it. So this would be what we would call our Crystal Vision recommended procedure. So. You'll have your tray ready. Um, I think that all of the stores, it's pretty standard to have the trays ready and set up either in front or slightly behind the uh, lab. I like to have mine in the office that I'm working at ready to go up front. And it, I think that it looks nice. Usually I'd have this guy tucked in right over there. Um, so I get the glasses from the back and I put them on the tray here and then I turn around and I show the tray to um, the customer. I will then take the glasses off. And this is really important that before the customer was here, I had the frames in what's called standard uh, standard adjustment. Bench aligned. Bench aligned, standard adjustment. So if you notice, the glasses are even on the on the table. The nose pieces are about uh, lined up away from the the frame, and it should look like a you know a fitting pair of glasses. Fitting also pair of glasses. even upside down, which is yeah, super interesting. Yeah, upside down as well. Yeah, and uh, what, what are we looking for there? Well, I'm looking to make sure that the lenses are properly aligned. So I'm going to tilt it upwards like this, and I'm going to check to see that the lenses are showing at the approximate same um, distance so that they're not going to be uneven on the face like that. When the lenses are aligned, after they're aligned, you're going to check to make sure that the frame temples are aligned so that you can align the temples. And then if you have to move this, of course, they're going to be out of alignment. So you want to do this first and then align the frame temples. After you align the frame temples, and you can see this is actually Jasmine's frame, so it, it doesn't sit perfectly. Most people's ears are actually slightly out of measurement. Yep. And in this case, it's, it's already been done to Jasmine. But And this would be the critical one right here, because this would show you if it's going to be well straight on somebody with normal ears. That's all. Yep. <laughs> so after, once they're in standard adjustment, they should be coming out here for dispensing. Um, you don't really want anything to be coming out here unless you've already checked for standard adjustment in the back. Yep. But now that we're out here, I'm going to ask Jasmine to put on her pair of glasses and I'm going to sit and just wait for just a second while she gets accustomed to them and tries them on. She wants to look around and check her prescription like a regular customer would. And you can see this is a very gorgeous pair of glasses on Jasmine. Well, they're very straight. They look nice, but they were pre-adjusted. So. Okay, so now, in order to adjust them, I want to ask, hey, how do they feel? You know, how's the vision? It's good. It's all good? Perfect. How are they feeling behind the ears? Actually, a little bit tight. They're feeling a little bit tight. So I'm going to walk around, and a proper dispense includes walking around behind here and checking. So I'm going to pull the hair back, and I'm going to move the ear, and I'm going to take a look here and see. So one thing that I notice, the hair is pinching there a little bit so you can't see it. But this frame is actually rubbing on the inside here and it's leaving a little red mark on, on Jasmine in there. And if they were to move around at all, it would be hitting on the ear. So I want to move that a little bit further away there. The bend. You want to yeah, move the, the bend. bend the bend back. And then I'll, this is sitting actually on a nice spot. Um, this ear here, this ear, this uh, bone here, it has no nerve endings in the it. The mastoid bone. The mastoid bone. And uh, you should be able to rest the frame on the back side of it nicely without causing any discomfort. So that's what we're going to do. <laughs> I'm going to take the frame to the back and heat them up just so there's no damaging on the frame. Okay. So I've now adjusted the frames in the back and Jasmine was letting me know that they feel amazing on her now and uh, they weren't slipping. So that's the next thing that I'd like to test just to make sure that they're not going to slip on her. So I'm going to get you to look down, give me a little bit of a shake there and we can see that they're not slipping on her. They held and uh, she still feels, I believe, comfortable in them, right? Perfect. Next, we're going to pick out our cases. So the one that we have in the tray here for the purpose of this video is a Crystal Vision case like I've gone through. Um, that pair of glasses that Jasmine has, has on is a Ray-Ban. So I would be getting a Ray-Ban case for her. Um, all of our designer brands should be coming with cases. So you can ask your manager where those cases are for what frames in your particular store. And just make sure you get them the case that they are uh, entitled to with their purchase. Um, any of our regular frames, if you want to turn around, uh, 
that and, and look at all of the frames. So the ones that are on my stands here would be our standard frames, and those ones would all come with Crystal Vision cases. The ones on the walls are all designers, and they get their own cases. Ah, okay. So we'll make sure that the frame goes in the case properly. Um, a lot of people don't know how the frames necessarily go in or that there's a way. What you'll want to do is stick the nose, the, the ear pieces towards you and just make sure that they tuck in there and close it off. If you notice, um, the back side here is the thickest part and it should be aligned with the top of the lens frame because this right here is going to be the thickest part of the joints. So you want to make sure that the, again, ear pieces are facing you and it will close up like that. Okay, these ones fit, so I know that this is a good case for her. She's going to be wanting to wear them, so I'm going to take them out of the case, but I want to show her that I'm making sure it fits. So I'll get you to put those back on, and you're welcome to you know, walk away with them. And then we'll stick everything else in the bag. Oh, we may have forgotten a very important step. Now, I'm sure Luke did this on purpose. So, I've got the bag ready here for you. And before you go, I just want to show you how to clean the glasses, because this is really important as well, especially for first-time glasses wearers. Hello, welcome back to Dispensing 101. I, this is going to be the ending of uh, the dispensing video. Um, it's the most important part about the finishing of the dispense is teaching a customer how to clean their glasses. Um, cleaning your glasses prevents warranty problems and it prevents our customers from having to come back in with these problems, which is always a hassle for them. Um, this is Courtney. Hello. Courtney is our uh, model and she's new, so uh, yeah. Hi, I've been here for about a week. I'm super excited to be in this video though. <laughs> <laughs> so, we have already gone through everything that we're, we're giving our customer here for the value. And then I'm going to ask to take back their glasses just for a second so I can show them how to clean them properly. Now in your dispensing drawers, you should have your cotton cloth, some microfiber cloths, and of course your cleaner. Now when we clean the glasses, you want to spray each, each lens on both sides. You can see I did the underside and the top side. You're going to rub it with your fingers, and uh, that's a really important step. You're going to, one, get rid of all of the oils and greases that are on top of it by actually scrubbing them away. And two, why you use your fingers is that your fingers are really good at feeling if there's any debris and try to, you know, obviously not scratch that debris in, but push it to the sides. You're then going to dry it off with your cotton cloth, just like so. And then after they're dry, they might still have a few either fluffs from the cotton cloth or a little smear of moisture on the surface. Then you're going to use the uh, microfiber. Now these microfibers are not meant for uh, wet use. You never want to get them wet. And uh, you want to tell the customer that as well because we've had a lot of people use them wet and then after you use them wet, they're basically garbage. And uh, they come back and complain saying that the glasses are impossible to clean when really this is the problem. Um, so that's the first way to clean them. If, if you can tell your customer that if these are not available, you can just use this but use it dry. And it's always a good idea to blow off the lenses first, just any debris to get it off. Um, after you clean them, you're just going to do a quick final check to make sure that they're adjusted. And then we'll give them back to our customer to obviously put on and uh, ask how the vision is. Looks good. <laughs> Okay, and then so are you going to be wearing those ones out? I will be. Perfect, so I'm just going to finish by putting everything in the bag for her and uh, we'll send her on her way. And this should be in the um, case there, but uh, it already had one. So I'll give that to you there. And uh, don't you. shake your hand and say thank you very much for your business, we appreciate it, and please tell all your friends and family about us. Um, and that's a very important step. If you don't tell them, they don't do it. Thank you very much. <laughs>